Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to perform some keyword extraction in Python. Um, we're we're going to be using an open source uh, package called Rake NLTK, which is based on the Rake algorithm uh, to extract keywords. Rake stands for Rapid Automatic Keyword Extraction. It was developed by researchers and has since been adopted into several open source packages. Um, essentially, Rake tries to find uh, keywords based on word frequencies and co-occurrences with other words in a document. Um, here we have an input text on computer science from Wikipedia. It's a fairly short document, um, but this is just to kind of show the power of Rake. It performs fairly well on a document of this size. Um, the larger the text, the better it may perform. So we're gonna start by um, first installing Rake. Um, you can do that via pip. I already have um, the package downloaded, but this is the command you'll need. I'll have all this in the description below as well. Um, and we can import Rake right now. And what we're gonna do is call a new object or instance of it and pass it in this input text to extract the keywords and then we'll print them out and kind of see what we're dealing with here. Um, this command real quick. I think it's extract keywords from text. We'll pass in this input text here. And now we're going to print the uh, the ranked phrases in order from highest score to lowest score. I also forgot to mention, um, if you haven't installed NLTK, you may be missing a couple of um, packages which kind of uh, contain information such as stop words, which are words like and, a, the that are pruned from text and then punctuation characters. Um, this library is dependent on these being installed. We can do this with this command um, in the terminal here. I'll also have this in the description. But essentially we're downloading um, a corpus of punctuation characters and then a corpus of stop words. Um, this is the English corpus. Um, I think if you wanted to do other languages as well, you could download those from Rake. Cool, so now we should be able to print down and get our ranked phrases. Let's do that right now. Okay, fairly large list. We have a couple of words in here that are like a single word rather than um, you know, a two word keyword like computer science or computer programming. Um, we can try and make this output a little bit better by um, pruning out the initial output and maybe kind of pruning the input text to remove odd characters such as this closing parenthesis here. So let's start by just pruning um, single phrase words out from our output. So let's assign this to keywords. And then let's print out, um, actually you also notice here we have computer science twice. We can get rid of this by just creating a set. Um, so we'll just get a single occurrence of those words. A set for each keyword in keyword. Just list comprehension. If the uh, keyword is only one word, we want to prune it out. So we're, we're going to split the text and check the length. So keyword dot split which should split on um, the space character. The length of that is greater than one. We want to keep it. Um, so this should produce keywords that are at least uh, two two words long. Which it definitely does now. See, we're still seeing that weird software uh, closing parenthesis period. We probably can prune our input text a little bit to get rid of these parentheses. Right. So let's replace the open parenthesis with nothing and then replace the closing parenthesis with nothing. So we should see um, maybe this will start to disappear. And then if it's just software, it's not two words, so it shouldn't be in our final output list. And yep. Yeah. So now, now this is kind of our, our list of um, you know candidate keywords from this small document. I think it does a pretty good job describing the actual text. You know, it's, it's on computer science. It has words such as information theory, computer science, um, computer programming. Um, 
the larger the input text document, the better this output could be. You can kind of play around with that over time, as well as different uh, text pruning techniques or output pruning techniques. But yeah, um, this is just a, a simple way to extract keywords in Python. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one.